We're gonna name it the nightmare as usual Or the bad dream. Let's call him the bad dream. All right. We've got the seamoth going. I want to hang everything over the side Everything's gonna the entire base is just gonna be hanging off the side here Boom, baby there it is the final final explosion of the Aurora What is going on, gaming nerds? Welcome back to Midnight Gaming with Mr. Gamer. Thanks for coming to the channel and hanging out. Hopefully, you guys are having an amazing day. I'm having a pretty decent day. It is midnight yet again, and yet again, we are back on sub 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 Subnautica. Sub sub I'm doing a subsistence and a Subnautica playthrough, guys, and they're hard to say, okay? They're hard to distinguish. Actually, they're completely different, but the names are hard to say. So, anyway, what I was doing, <laughs> we're back on Subnautica. Yeah, that's what it was. Midnight, back on Subnautica. I'm making filtered water. I'm getting ready for the episode. Um, and I've gone down and remember all those crashes that chased us when we first started in the last episode? If you watched it, I don't think a lot of you did if you're watching this one because there was only 10 views. You guys suck. Actually, there's like 14, but that's okay. So I went out and copper copper let's make some batteries let's make some batteries i'm getting prepared um we need a couple of batteries i want a couple of extra for uh the sea glide i think i'm going to use one of them uh for the builder tool where's the builder tool right there we need the laser cutter too which means we should probably go out and get diamonds for that uh for the computer, let's see, computer chip, wiring kit, battery. So with the wiring kit, did we make a wiring kit? Did we have one? No, we did not. We need two silver for that, right? Okay, so that's one of the things we need to do. Um, ta, 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 ta. What do we need for this, though? What do we need for the builder? Habitat builder. Computer chip, wiring kit. For the wiring kit, we need, for the computer chip, we just need copper wire which is the two copper that i just used for the batteries and two table coral samples and then we also need a wiring kit which is two more silver okay so here's what i'm going to do i know a good spot i know a couple of good spots i found some more quartz too for 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 copper and for silver Let's go ahead and take two of these out. Let's put you two in there just so we don't lose you. We got a whole bunch of water. Good to go. Let's use one of those now. We got some peepers. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I know a really good spot for copper and for silver. We need to go get some of that stuff. Um, we really need to make the builder because I want to make more storage. I'm tired of passing up stuff uh, that we can use. Um, where? Damn it. Where am I? I got to go down that hole again. Where is the hole? There's the hole. To figure out where I'm at. For some reason, it's this hole just takes me to a place where I know what we need to go. I know where we're at. Okay? I'm just saying it's a thing. Well, it's, is it copper? Copper? Nope. Not copper. Okay. So, copper? Copper. Yes. Copper. Okay. We got some more copper. All right. Um, so, let's see. You go out here. You come over here. There should be a drop off. There's that wreckage over there. Then you follow this around the outside and I'll be back when we get there is there a hidden <gasps> mobile vehicle bay yes okay that should yes that got our mobile vehicle bay good to go okay good 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 okay so here's the whole there's this thing in the that I was talking about with some decent copper uh it used to have decent copper oh my gosh there's nothing on it anymore devs you're mean to us you hate us why do you hate us so much Okay, let's go ahead and get some air. We'll go down in here, get some more copper. The search for copper is real, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, we got some more copper. Good, 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 good. Oh, even more copper. Okay, we got plenty of storage or inventory. Let's see if we can get a little bit more here. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to the volcano area, the, 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 the what are they called? The spewing volcano areas of doom. Is this? Copper? Yes, copper. 
Wait, this is not the area I was looking for. This is there's a hidden area over here. Okay. No, I just want this. Okay, is there any crashies in here? Because I knew this was in here. Hopefully we can get a little bit of silver. Here. Okay, there's gold, there's lead. There's a little bit of silver. Yep. Uh, I didn't realize there was a crashy in here. We're getting out, we're getting out. We're go, 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 go. He blew up somewhere else. <laughs> okay, so if you go across from this tube over here, I'm going to look at our inventory. Um, let's just, yeah, we're okay for now. Uh, let's just go ahead and go across over here. Down here is where the bubbling bubbles come from, the hot lava area. Let's go ahead and get a drink, or not a drink, um, a drink of air. Let's get a drink of air. And we can go straight down. Okay, and then in these holes right here are my favorite places to get silver and gold. Gold, silver, lead. Uh, can we get some copper from this? Yes, we can, if we can pick it up. Okay, silver, gold, lead, silver. Nice. Okay, how many silver we got? We got one, two, three. We only got three. Okay, let's start emptying these out so we can get a little bit more in here. Uh, more copper, please? Nope. Ah. This is the one that we just went into, right? Yes, okay. So I think there's another one over here. Copper? Yes, copper. Okay, silver. Oh, there's some more silver. Okay, we're really getting going good going. Yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're getting... Oh, no, we're full. Inventory full. That's it. We're taking all this out because we need this stuff. We don't really need the titanium. And it looks like I'm being hurt, but I'm actually not. So what we're going to do is we're going to go a little bit deeper. We're going to go up and we're going to get some air. We're going to go down. We're going to go a little bit deeper in the hole. It's going to look like I'm being hurt, but I'm actually not being hurt. So I'm okay. Don't worry about me, guys. Uh, yep. Yeah, let's just use all this. I want to fill our inventory completely up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. A little bit more silver, please. No, that's gold. Didn't want that. Okay, copper's good. Okay, we got three more. Hopefully we can get three more silver. Okay, there's one silver. Nope, there's lead. I know, I know. Please, please. God, another lead? Seriously? Okay, so we're absolutely full. Let's head back to base. Okay, we're almost back to base. And I just wanted to inform you guys that I have exceeded my... My, my daily exercise regiment of 500%. And I need to make sure to keep, you know, my muscles uniform by varying my whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, uh, we got a problem. We're completely full of everything. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. We needed... Uh, we had no more room, so we need to do this. Let's go ahead and do a copper wire. That'll get rid of one area. Let's go ahead and do the wiring kit. That'll get rid of another two. Now, can we make... What is this? Oh, mobile vehicle bay. Sweet! Can we make... Oh, we can. Titanium ingot for the mobile vehicle bay. That one takes a long time. Uh, mobile vehicle bay, lubricant, and power cell. Okay, so... What was I doing? I was doing the habitat builder. Computer chip. Battery wiring kit. Okay, so we've got the wiring kit... Uh, but we need the computer chip, which is two table coral samples. Do we have enough room? Yes, we do. Okay, let's go get two table coral samples. Where are you table coral? There we go. Let's go ahead and do these guys right here. One and two. Okay, so there's our computer chip, which is going to help us get the habitat builder. Now I need to figure out where we're going to build base. Uh, and I have no idea where we're going to build base, but 
We gotta make it a good one. Somewhere slightly deeper. And, but not too deep to where it, you know, goes absolutely nuts when it comes down to, like, lag and stuff. Okay, so Habitat Builder is made. The Builder 2 is designed the builder to two. Sweet. Okay, so now we can start... Are you done? We can start building a base. Uh, let's see. Should we go over and check out Life Pod 3 real quick in the shallows? Hmm... Or should we make the mobile vehicle bay? Where where is it? Where where did it go? It was right here. Mobile there it is, right there. Lubricant and a power cell. Okay, so to make a power cell, we need silicone rubber and two batteries. Two batteries now? That sucks. We can take one out of the sea glide. We're gonna need to make another battery anyway, too. So we might as well just, we've got enough copper to make all the batteries we need to make. Uh, let's just make two more batteries and then, let's see, we said we needed lubricant, right? Okay, so we have enough for two. Let's go over, uh, where is, I know there's a close vine area right by. Where, where did it go? It was right, where did it go? Ha, found it found it okay we're gonna grab two of these we're gonna make some lubricant then we're gonna get a more mobile vehicle bay and once we get the mobile vehicle bay maybe we should look into getting the sea moth too that way we can kind of tool around a little bit and find a really nice spot um just to make our base area hello okay there's the shallows that's only 500 meters away. are we full yeah we're full of crap okay so I'm, i mean i'm always full of crap i'm just saying Let's go back to base and let's see if we can go ahead and make the mobile vehicle bay. We'll open that up, um, put that out, and look at what it's going to take to make a sea moth. Then maybe we can tool around in that. Looks like we got a message. Let's go ahead and listen to that real quick. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora, do you read? Over. No, why did I just make a beacon? Not on the vacuum. These Altera ships. They run low on engine grease, they send an SOS. You offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's going to take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn charter's going to have us blowing our credits, running errands for Altera. See what the long-range stands pick up in the meantime. Okay, we got some guys that are going to try and help us out. That's awesome. Okay, so we unloaded that battery. Let's go ahead and put the ch a new charge into there. How much is this more? 74, 92. Uh, let's go ahead and unload the battery on this one. Hold on, we need to make another battery first. Battery, okay. Excellent. All right, now unload the battery on this one. Load up this battery, turn this off. Okay, so now we should have two really crappy batteries. Okay, we got two, not real crappy, but they're beacon. Why did I make a beacon? Uh, okay, so let's make, let's make one more battery. Mine as well. Let's go ahead and make the power cell. I bet you 20 bucks it used the 100% battery. How much you want to bet it used my 100% battery I just made? Son of a, I knew it. I knew it. Why? Why devs? You hate us, don't you? You hate us all. Okay, so let's see. Can we make... Okay, so the mobile vehicle bay. Do we have enough room? I don't know if we have enough room. Oh, crap. Okay. Um, another, be another battery? <laughs> we have batteries coming out of our yin-yang now. That's good, though. That's good. Okay, so, mobile vehicle... Wait, why am I going to this for the mobile vehicle? Mobile vehicle bay. Making it now. All right, here we go. Ooh, this is a real long one. Nailed it! All right, let's do this. Let's come over. Yes, I'm going to release it. Why do you think I'm in the water? Let's go right here. It's probably going to be a little bit... A little bit janky. That's totally not how you release it. Whoop. Two. Okay. Awesome. 
Put you back in here. All right, so what do we need for the sea motham? Oh, nice little animation. Sea moth, another power cell, two glass, lead, lubrication, and, a and one titanium ingot. Power cell, glass, lead. I think we can actually do that, can't we? I do. Uh, do I have enough for another titanium ingot? Where's the... Okay. Let's see if I can get everything together. Hopefully we can we can do this. Okay, we got another message. Hopefully it's them feeling really bad. No, it's a distress call. Is life pod six. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Bye six. Coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. Warning. Local radiation readings suggest the Aurora's drive core has Ooh. reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. Oh no. That sucks. Guess what? We got enough for da -da -da -da, the sea moth. Ha <laughs> ha. fast, safe mode of transport. But remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. We're going to name it The Nightmare, as usual. Or The Bad Dream. Let's call him The Bad Dream. All right. We've got the sea moth going. Excellent. Okay. So now what we need to do is we need to find a place that we can just just just, just base down. We need to base down. Uh, okay. So for, for doing that, we need to switch you out, switch you over. Okay. So we're going to need the quartz. Uh, let's see. For a hatch. So we're going to take all the quartz, we're going to take the copper, uh, we're going to take the titanium, just for right now, okay? Just just for right now, don't worry, it's okay. So we'll be able to make a hatch. Now, I want to be able to make one foundation. Okay, so we're going to need the lead for that. So every... Wow, they changed the foundations to lead? Ugh. Ugh. Ugh, ugh, ugh. We might as well just take it all. Should we just take it all? Anyway, the biggest thing that I'm worried about right now... Okay, so we have... Okay, we're good for that. That we need another one. Uh, another uh, fragment for. And this. Table coral sample. Okay, so we actually have enough for the fabricator as well. And then quartz and stuff. Okay, so we're actually doing pretty good. Let's go ahead and grab this. I think we can just grab everything. We might as well just grab everything. And I think we're done here. Um, mobile vehicle bay, we're probably, I'm going to have to come back for that. So for right now, I do have that beacon, right? Yeah. Okay. So that beacon will place that out, um, when we get to our new base area. So I'm going to go ahead and tool around for a little bit, Welcome turn off the lights, and we are going to see if we can find a decent place to base up a little bit. I'm thinking maybe we should maybe we should make it not too deep but still close to the shallows so we can get lots of quartz and stuff and I don't have to travel very far um not down there let's let's go this way okay so I lied we're quite a bit further out here than I was expecting but I found a spot that I've I've camped at before I've based at this area before I absolutely love it look how far away we are we're pretty stinking far away, but that's okay because that the, the 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 what do you call it? The life pod shows me where the shallow is, and then we've got the aurora right there. I'm surprised the aurora hasn't actually blown up yet. Um, I think we're actually by a debris field down there. So I think what we're gonna do, and I've actually did this in the very first season. Uh, do not go look up the very first season. This is the same place that we camped back then, but. I had a really bad mic and I had a, a, a worse computer, so don't go look at that, please. Um, anyway, we're going to camp here. And this is a really cool spot. You got some really cool vine areas, little caves over here. Down below us, we've got the mushroom biome, which is really cool. And then not too far from us, a little bit that way, we've got the shallow. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off by putting down a foundation. Now, I think I'm gonna have to go find some more uh, uh, titanium, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna hang it off the side here. 
I'm actually thinking maybe we won't do that. I thinking I'm thinking maybe what we could do is we could do a T. No, we're gonna have to do it this way. We're gonna have to have a way to get in and then a way. Okay, so let's just hang it. I want to hang everything over the side. Everything's gonna the entire base is just gonna be hanging off the side here. Uh, okay, so let's just go ahead and maybe what we'll do is we'll put one. We'll put one. Uh, uh, what are they called? Uh, uh, Multi-purpose room right there on the edge, hooked to this. When we actually go over to the other island or to the island, the solid island, we get the um, we get the multi-purpose room. We'll put a multi-purpose room right there off the edge, and then off the uh, off the edge of that, we'll put all of our um, our moon pools, and maybe we'll put like another multi-purpose room over here and a multi-purpose room over here. Whatever. Uh, we'll go ahead and do this right now, and then we need to go ahead and put a hatch inside it. Once we get the hatch done, which for some reason um, I've used all the titanium up, which sucks. I gotta get back in here. Okay, so I need to go find... Uh, what do we have? Yeah, we need some more titanium. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go find some titanium. Okay. Found a little bit more titanium. I don't know how much this is actually gonna help us out. Hopefully we can get the solar panel done. Okay, solar panel's done. But we've got no... yeah. The quantum uh, the quantum detonation. We are way the hell out here, guys. We're gonna have to watch it from the night time. Let's go up to the surface. There she is. Boom, baby. There it is. The final, final explosion of the Aurora on the finished game. Actually looks kind of creepy at night with the lights of the Seamoth on it. Radiation suit. Okay, so we got the radiation suit blue suit blue blueprint. The radiation suit has been added to your blueprint database. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. So now what we need to do is I need more quartz because I need to find uh, I need to get glass so I can have more storage. We're we're actually getting pretty thirsty too, and I ate I drank all of those whatchamacallits. Okay, uh, the other thing that we need is we also need to be able to make a fabricator. The fabricator takes a table coral sample. I think we should be able to find one of those just right outside here, hopefully. Or all they all are they all in the shallows? Seriously? I think they're all in the shallows. By the way, that little box right there, I got titanium out of that. Well, I did get titanium. I actually got the laser cutter out of that. Um, I finished off the laser cutter blueprint, which is really good for us. Quartz, or not quartz, but uh, copper. Uh, seriously? There's absolutely no table coral samples around here. Are, are there some over here? Seriously? Is it just in the shallows is where they're at? I don't remember them just being in the shallows. Oh my gosh, do I really have to go find some? This is insane. I thought I had everything when we came over here. I just forgot to get the table coral sample so we could make the stupid fabricator. I went all the way back to our live pod to do this properly. Let's get this done properly. I left some of the stuff back there. I got enough. I got enough for a fabricator, which we're going to throw. Let's see, we're going to be building out that direction. Um, let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and put this right here. Okay. And then let's go ahead and grab one locker. We'll throw you right there. Doesn't have to be perfectly straight. We're going to get rid of this T section or this, this cross section pretty soon here. And then we're going to put a locker here just for extra storage. All right. Now... Let's go ahead and put the lead, put everything in here for power. What are we looking for for power? Let's see. We need, nope, this, that, that didn't here. And then power we're going for. Okay, so we need titanium, copper, everything we just put in there. But I don't think we have enough quartz because it did say two quartz, right? Yeah, two quartz. Okay, so we don't have enough for the first second one of those. Uh, okay, so 
Let's go ahead and throw everything in here. We've officially moved over to this area, which is awesome. But what we need to do now is we need to throw our beacon up so I can figure out where we're at. Now, if you guys are wondering where this is and you like this base area, on the coordinates, I'm at negative 400. If you look at the camera world position, I'm at negative 468 and uh, negative 68 because we're underwater and then positive 427. So that's the camera world position of negative six, 468. God, I can't talk. Negative 68 and 427. Okay, so this is where this is. We're going to hang everything over the side here. And a couple of the multi-purpose rooms off of the side. We probably should go over and get those um, over at the main island pretty soon here. But, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. I just wanted to change the... Okay, edit beacon. Main base of awesomeness... It actually will let me do that. I was thinking it wasn't going to let me do this. Do it that way. We're just going to say main base of awesome. This would be cool, but that's cool. Okay, so there's our first base. We're doing good. We're doing awesome. We're powered up. We can get oxygen in here. Um, we've got our fabricator in. We really need to go over and look at... Um, what is it for... Let's see. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Just, just, just. Okay. What is it for the, the this thing? Because we have a radio message. Copper and titanium. That's it. Do we have that? Copper. Titanium. We got it. Let's do it. Nailed it. Right here. Let's go ahead and listen to this message. Maybe it's the sunbeam feeling bad for us. This is nope. Officer Keen in light pod 19. 19. The captain is gone. Oh, no. I have assumed command. Okay. The last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land. Dry land. We group one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site. Stay together and good luck. Okay, so that's basically this tell. Now repeat. That's ba coordinates corrupted. <clears throat> Transmission origin coordinates downloaded. That's telling us. Seriously, lady. Detecting increased foreign bacteria levels in the water. Performing a self-scan is advised. Self-scan. Scan me, baby. Self-scan complete. Vital signs normal. Detecting trace amounts of foreign bacteria. Continuing to monitor. Are you done? Can I talk now? Okay, so as far as the storyline's going, that's telling us, okay, dry land is over there. We need to go over there. We can get the multi-purpose rooms over there. There's a couple of beacons we need to go to life pod 3 uh sea glide damage there's life pod 19 now life pod 19 is actually pretty good because you can get a whole bunch of rubies right by it but it's fairly deep i believe if i remember right so yeah that's good okay so ooh, is this oh more lead is that uh no it's not Ooh, are those new oh hello tiger plant i didn't realize you were down there my bad can we get okay we can get another one of those does that mean we can put in another power thing uh we really need to find the other uh uh, uh bioreactor like badly um that'd be really nice to have once we get our multi-purpose room i think we've got another yes we do okay and then for this power no, why do I keep going there for power? No, no, no. Titanium and copper ore. We've only got one titanium, really. No, we don't. You know, we got one more. We're good to go. Okay, let's just go ahead and throw this on here real quick. Just for a little bit extra power. We probably don't even need it, to be honest with you. But still, we'll just throw that on there. We'll have two solar panels. That'll be really, really, really good for us. Okay, biggest base, greatest base ever. And we've got a beacon on it. So that's pretty cool. And like I said, there's... Over here, we've got vines. So we can get a whole bunch of vine stuff over here. Down here, we've got the mushroom biome. Where we can find a lot of the cyclops uh, parts and stuff like that. And then behind us, where the life pod is, that's where the shallows is. So everything's pretty close right here. We did really good. We got the sea moth. Uh, I need to go back and I need to get the mobile vehicle bay and bring it back out here. Grab the rest of our our supplies and stuff. Um, 
But we did really, really good. We finally got the mobile vehicle bay, which is awesome. That only took two episodes. That guy was infected back there, by the way. That was cool looking. Uh, so, yeah, that, I think, is pretty much it. We finally got our base location up. We've got a beacon. Does the beacon show? Yep, the beacon shows. Main base of awesomeness. And then we've got, um, we've got the storyline for us to go over that direction and get to the main base, so we'll, or not the main base, but the, the floating island, so we'll probably head over there next episode, but as of right now, that's it for today. We got quite a bit done, a lot of technological logical advancements. If you liked the video, hit the like button. If you didn't, don't hit it. Just make sure no matter what you do, subscribe. Thanks for coming to the channel and hanging out. Hopefully you guys had a good time. I did. Keep gaming, keep doing it, man. I have a blast. We'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Have a good one. Bye-bye.